Welcome everybody to uh, beautiful Lisboa. Um, my name is Stephen Wally and I, uh, I work for Microsoft uh, and I'm one of the team of partners that helped lift the SDV working group into place uh, under the umbrella of the, the Eclipse Foundation. So I currently serve as the chair of the working group steering committee. Um, our scope is really clear. Uh, you know, we're building, and I'll read it to you because it's that boring, uh, an open technology platform for the software defined vehicle of the future, focused on accelerating innovation on automotive grade in-car software stacks using open source and open specifications developed together in community. And so what, what does that really mean? Um, as a set of industry partners, we're taking a code first approach. And this is a way that allows us as engineers to accelerate innovation. Uh, we are working together to build these frameworks and test these frameworks together and to learn how these components will best work together and then evolve them into the stacks that we hope to build. Um, it's that collaboration that makes a, dif a difference. I've been involved in open standards and open source projects for a very long time now. And the Eclipse Foundation is an engineering centric organization that provides the process and rigor and support for all of us to work together and do this job together. Um, we are not here to pick winners. That's a really important thing to, to kind of hold. We're, we are here to build healthy open source licensed project building blocks and then to find the way these components work together. Um, we saw some of that collaboration firsthand. Uh, the Bosch Connected World Hackathon at the end of last year. Uh, that was, it followed on kind of our first couple of events, our, our calls for projects as we were doing this kind of source code first approach. And those were last June and then September. And by the time we came to November, we had a very successful hackathon. And we saw folks actually starting to pull these projects together. And that's kind of the, this experimentation and the continuance of that is what we're here for for the next couple of days. Um, this is our first event of this year, and you know, there's going to be presentations this afternoon and through tomorrow that really continue to build on this idea of collaborating together and exploring these projects together, um, working towards building these technology stacks that we want to you know, deliver into the industry together. Um, we are now at 35 members, which is fantastic considering we are really just a year old. And as the SDV working group, uh, we've expressed a, our support for 15 projects, which by the end of the week will be closer to 20. So this is, this is a huge lift for our first year together. Um, we, are, you know, we continue to evolve the organization together with the strong support of the Eclipse Foundation. And I'm looking forward to our next events this year as we continue to roll this forward into the stacks of technology we want to build. With that, I'm going to stop talking because you don't need to hear any more introductions, but I would like to turn the microphone over to Michael Plaga, uh, who's helped. He's, he's been kind of the, at the center of this from the Eclipse uh, Foundation side. And so I wish to I, I want to wish you all a great event. Thank you. Thanks a lot, Stephen, for the friendly words. Um, yeah, I would like to say thank you to Microsoft for hosting us. And I would like to say a special thank to Philippe, who is doing all the heavy lifting of that event. <laughs> and not, not, only, not only for the event, I think he's also one of the very active community members, and that's just fun to see everyone. Um, yeah, from contribution to community. So Stephen always said that we had our contribution days last year. We mainly focused on adding new projects. Now we, I would not call it change focus, but we move it a little bit from not only contribution, but also community building. So now we have, I like to call it 15 islands. And by end of this event, we would have 20 islands. And the main purpose of this event is building bridges between these islands. Because if we have 20 different islands, they are beautiful. Each island is a nice place to be. But if you cannot come from one island to the other, I think we have nothing achieved. So building these bridges between the island, combining the projects into something meaningful, which we may want to call later on distribution, that's what we plan. And as the organization has grown, um, we also have grown as a team handling this one. 
they're more than happy to hand over the moderation to Sarah Galleon, the STV program manager. I think most of you will know her quite well. And the rest of the event is yours, sir. Yes, thanks a lot. Thank you. Thank you, Michel. And uh, yeah, I also want to acknowledge Polly, who most of you already know. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so she's been, of course, uh, of incredible help in organizing all of this. Yeah, so you all know me because I've been pestering you for the last month. Uh, but um, let me, maybe, but maybe not. It was working before. <laughs> yeah, so I just want to recap what is the goal of the event? So yeah, so we already had as a working group some uh, uh, some contribution days. What uh, are we changing now and what are the goal of this event? So first of all, get to know the new project. We are onboarding five new projects and uh, and this is amazing and we have a lot of new members. I'm going to go into detail later, but uh, try to get to know the people that you are going to work with remotely, obviously, but try to get uh, to know them, to build a relationship with them. Um, get to know the new collaboration partners. We have a couple of new collaboration partners, the, the guys from 42 Wolfsburg. Try to get in touch with them. Uh, they will have a presentation later. We have the friends from, uh, from Eclipsea and Eclipse Source. Uh, get to know them, listen to what they have to tell you. And uh, yeah, but most importantly, at least for me, is please work towards a distribution, distributions. So really the goal of this event, in my opinion, is moving the first steps toward, uh, toward having a showcase distribution or more than one. We have thought about a number of use cases, Natch is going to introduce them, and uh, please take the time to sit together on a table and just work on your laptop and see that you whatever what you can do with the presence of others today. Um, yeah, take the chance to talk to our tech uh, talk experts. We have invited a bunch of, of experts to talk um, on, a, on a core topic that is of interest to everyone. Take the time to talk to them, ask them questions. And then finally, but not so last but not least, uh, you know, we've had a number of uh, technical breakout groups. Um, some, some of you uh, have already participated. That's great. Uh, but have a look at their findings, listen to what they do and please participate. Yeah, next, please. Yeah, so I said we have new members. Uh, we are welcoming. Actually, we have welcomed in the last days. Um, LGE, so our first participant member from Korea. So we are expanding the STV working group footprint is almost everywhere. And on the other side of the Atlantic, uh, GM joined us. Uh, you might have noticed the wonderful T-shirts. Uh, they're going to contribute. They are contributing a couple of, uh, of projects. They also have a tech talk on their new protocol. So yeah, thanks a lot and welcome. And then yeah, so this is the same slide. Um, yeah, so here I've tried to add five of the new projects, uh, but they are going to explain to you later what this is about. But if you've never seen this, uh, this picture before, this is our STV landscape. So where are most of our projects located? Agenda. So I'm just going to go through real quick. So we are going to start with a new project presentation. I will be doing the timekeeping quite aggressively because we have such. <laughs> yeah, basically, I'm going to kick you off the stage if you if you're not done in time. I mean, we have some buffer, but still we have a quite packed schedule, which I'm really happy about. Uh, we have new projects, uh, Eclipse Moek, Petricom, Heimlich, earlier known as Sindri. Uh, developer console uh, and then new protocol SDK and Android and there's a bunch of presenter. I'm going to introduce them later and then we have a presentation from our new collaboration, uh, the uh, 42 Wolfsburg Academy. Um, what we want to do is we want to uh, take a step toward teaching, toward uh, making uh, people adopt our projects and, and I think that going in this direction, having an academic partner it's going to be of, of really strong benefit for us all. Uh, then we're going to have the two tech talks uh, with our with two um, two experts from, from Microsoft. 
and then we are going to go into a sort of open-ended panel uh, which is going to be led by the facilitators and the biggest contribution to our two breakout groups. So they have 20 minutes each, uh, but it, this is really an open-ended discussion. So uh, whomever interested can stay and can stay longer, and then we are going to head off to cocktail. Oh, and the prospect of the cocktail. Yeah, I thought of removing, I thought of removing that line, I have to say that. <laughs> but no, so, but who, who stays? We'll have some special cocktails and so uh, nice. we'll, we'll save some <laughs> for sure. Then the second day is going to be also quite packed. Uh, we are starting with our uh, third tech talk uh, and then uh, we have an interesting uh, chariot massage. I don't know if uh, I don't see certain, but I hope you have. I hope you have a seat here that we can. <laughs> no joke. And uh, and then uh, Eclipse here, they are going to present the the Eclipsia project, which is a next generation tooling platform. So uh, as you know, Eclipse is famous for the IDE. This is a web based, um, this is a web based um, IDE, which I think will work really well for us. So we strongly uh, suggest that you have a look at it and think whether you can use it to just speed up your, your development. And then we have some uh, really interesting project updates, ECAL and Velocitas, and then um, and then we start with trying to work on the distribution, as I said earlier. So um, we are going to talk about a set of use cases that were discussed by the community and that were uh, ruled out as the most interesting ones to work on towards having a first distribution. Um, there are two of them, um, but uh, you can feel free to suggest new ones. But during the collaboration time, and we have a quite uh, quite long uh, time where there is nothing scheduled. Just please sit with one another. Please talk to your colleagues and think of working towards solving this use case. I mean, take it as a sort of small hack challenge. Uh, sit with your colleagues and think about how would you solve it with uh, the projects that we have. Um, and then in parallel toward the last hour of this open track, collaboration track, we'll have a uh, workshop held by the 42 Wolfsburg group and uh, where we will think about where do we see education and how do we think that we can contribute with educa to, to education and vice versa. So uh, we'll try to think about a collaboration modus with them and in parallel there's also a marketing track uh, that has the scope of devising metrics for, for projects and uh, that is going to be led by Paulina. So really every, something for everyone and uh, afterwards we are going to wrap up and um, talk about what we did, what were the what was the outcome of our collaboration, and then finally there's going to be a presentation from marketing as well. And with that, we yeah, can all go home or stay in Lisbon and enjoy the long weekend. And I think this is it. <laughs>